struggling today. As you can probably hear, I'm sick. Over the weekend, we had our barbecue brought over and Blake's parents bought us a outdoor setting. So we set that up and put that all outside. It's looking amazing. Today we are having some power stuff done uh, to get ready for the spa to be put in. Also a PowerPoint for the TV we're gonna put outside. It's gonna be full on entertaining area right there. I'm so excited. You gonna be in a video, darling? Oh, if I have to. <laughs> Are you serious, Danny? It is called Danny and Blake, you know. Oh, Danny, you're painful. Well, what's happening? We are hoping that the pergola is going to be put in next week. Fucking or the week, Or the week time. after, maybe. What want my spa there. Then we can put our spa there in time for your birthday. Me and Danny want to christen the spa. Shh. Today, my stepdad's coming over to take down the previous roof thing. Whatever you call it. Temporary roof thing that we had. Ready for the new one. What else is going on? Leo's going through a bit of a terrible time at the moment, but it's okay. Oh, we're out of lockdown this week, so I've been taking him out a lot and I think He's it's overwhelmed. Been definitely overwhelmed with life. What's going on with you, darling? Anything? Mate, nothing's changed with me. Mate, life's good. Pub's open. That is that is that is something. That's good. But apart from that, nothing's really changed here. I'm a bit fucking boring, aren't I? Mm, a little bit. Uh, potential of Twitch streaming again. We're Maybe. talking about it. We're talking wanna... about it. I want to promote my Twitch and see if I can get back on that old bandwagon, you know. But I need uh, ideas for games to play. Okay, I'm very excited because the pergola is being put up today. I actually messaged them last night because I was like, hey, any update? Like, it's Blake's birthday this weekend. We're having some people over, so I'd love to know when it's going to get done. And he was like, oh, I was actually about to message you. It's getting done tomorrow. And I was like, yes. So um, I had to get up early, which is super annoying because... I didn't have Leo last night, so I could have had a sleep in today, but I'd rather a pergola. So I woke up and I realized like the backyard <laughs> was not ready for workers. So I quickly just went out there and cleaned up all the dog poo, moved the chairs from the table so they weren't in the way. I couldn't move the table by myself, Blake's at work, so they're gonna have to do that if they need to move it. Um, and just, yeah, cleaned up, had a whole bunch of shit and I just had to block the side off so that the dogs aren't in their way. I'm just gonna have to keep a check on them all day because they might try and knock that wood over. But anyway, so I'm really excited for that to be done by the end of the day. They reckon that it's gonna be done by two. So I can't wait for them to get here and I'm just gonna put around the house today while the pergola gets done. Unfortunately, when the materials for the pergola were dropped off, they forgot a downpipe. Obviously, I didn't know. I wasn't sure what was meant to be there and what wasn't. And it was sitting out the front for a while. I highly doubt anyone stole it, but who bloody knows? So they kind of just asked me, have you seen a downpipe? And I was like, no. So they technically can't finish because they can't put the pipe there to drain the gutter. So I think he's just getting on the phone with the supplier now to sort that out. And unfortunately, he's going to have to come back to put that pipe on. But anyway, besides that, the pergola looks bloody awesome i think it's amazing still exciting even though they have to come back and do the pipe but the pipe is actually going on the opposite side to where the spa is going so it's not going to affect us getting the spa in so. so the down pipe got dropped off today so i have messaged the pergola guy and said it's here whenever you're ready i'm not sure what day he's going to be able to come back and do that my father-in-law and mother-in-law just came over just to have a look at the pergola my father-in-law is going to be putting the powerpoint and stuff for the spa in there so I just wanted to have a look at how that's all going to work. It's going to come from the house, go through that beam and down and connect to the spa. So exciting. I think that's going to go in tomorrow and then I can start filling it up and putting the chemicals in. I went and got all the chemicals yesterday. They also dropped off this TV, which is my sister-in-law's old TV. She got a new one. So we're going to use that TV for outside. And I just need to get a Google Chrome so that we can pretty much watch everything we want out there. That's what we do for inside anyway. It's all coming together. I just... I love looking outside, it just looks so nice. It honestly it just feels like a different house, but I love it. Okay, Pergola guy came back and put up the pipe. So that is done, Pergola is officially finished. I am really excited because I have a cleaner coming today, just because I feel, just because I feel like I've gotten really behind in the housework to a point where like I can't catch up. So I thought if I just got a cleaner to a really thorough clean, then I should be able to keep on top of it weekly after that, hopefully. So Blake's home today. So we're just going to 
<laughs> we're just going to head to the shops and have some lunch and take Leo out of the house just while the cleaner's here, just so they have free reign around the house. Hopefully we're getting the spa around the backyard this afternoon. Possibly might get the TV up on the wall as well. Are you all right? He's due for a feed. I'm gonna go, but we'll update you later. Oh, no. Got it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm scared. Let me tell you, when we get this around the back, we're never moving it again. Don't worry about the trolley. Just push towards us. Don't worry about the trolley. When the trolley's off, when the trolley's off, done. Okay, guys, stop. Right, mate. You got oh, it? Yeah, they were done with the eggs. Guys, that was so easy. You need my help? What are you doing in there? <laughs> what are you doing in there? <laughs> okay, guys, don't judge me. I, I just got my first lot of lip filler, so it's a little bit swollen. So please just bear with me. I'm going to be talking a little bit weird, but anyway. So we figured out the spa, it is warming up. I'm actually just about to go and feel it because like I said, it's actually working because it didn't seem like the heater was really working yesterday. So I'm just going to test it. It just looks so good out here and there's actually a lot more room than I thought there was going to be. Oh yeah, that's warming up. That's awesome. That is so good. Basically for the yard now, the screen door is really the only thing that we need. A will screen door and then the TV is going to go up in the corner there, which I think will be done tomorrow. And then I do want to look at getting some lights out there. So Blake's brother was here yesterday. He's an electrician. He was like, we can do this. We can do this. We can do this. He was very excited. So I think we're going to do like LED, like strip lights, like across the top. Oh, I'm so happy with it. Final backyard update for this YouTube video. Still waiting to get a quote for a screen door. Hopefully that'll be done in a few weeks, maybe. Haven't been able to get the TV up yet, but I'm sure that will be done shortly. Got the Chromecast for the TV. Just need to get some lights. But it currently looks awesome, even without all of that stuff. I just can't get over how good it looks. It just feels like such an entertaining area now and I can't wait to have people over and utilize it as much as I can. Bye. Thanks so much for watching. Make sure you follow our socials. Or you can just follow me because I'm better. Blake! What? Ugh.